Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here. Alright, so in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to use the green screen effect in Camtasia 9. Alright, so before I show you how to do it in Camtasia 9, I'm just going to show you a video I did using the green screen effect to show you what it can look like. So this is a video I have here. It was uh, when we got the green screen, I was just unboxing it and setting it up for the first time and testing it out. So I'm gonna play a part of the video where I actually do the green screen effect so that you can see how it works. Well, if we wanted to, but we don't need that that much space. All right, so now that we have everything set up, uh, let's. I'm just gonna stand in front of the screen and let's see what kind of different things we can put behind it. Let's see what it looks like. Obviously, when you're watching this, it's gonna have changed. So maybe I'm, I'm swimming, <laughs> or maybe I'm flying in the sky, or something, or maybe something's flying at me. You know, we don't know. We don't. We really don't know. But that's the beauty of green screen. All right, maybe we're vertical, and maybe I'm. I'm running on the street or something and there's like a chicken. I have no idea. And I jump. I don't know what's behind me, guys. All right, guys, so guys, so that... Okay, so that was uh, just a short clip of me testing out the green screen when we were unboxing it. As you can see, you can do some pretty cool, funny stuff with it. And uh, let's get into the tip. So first thing is when you're in Camtasia 9, you want to import your media. So you want to have a video with the green screen in the background. Like this isn't going to work if you haven't filmed your video with the green screen in the background. You can do it with other colors, but the green screen works the best because it's the easiest to remove because it's like such a vibrant color and it doesn't clash with anything that you can just easily remove it. When you have your clip on here and you have it with the green screen, as you can see, the green screen is behind me, you want to head over to more. And then you want to go to visual effects. All right, so here, you're going to see this, remove a color. You want to drag that down to your green screen clip that you filmed that you want to remove the background on. And we have the effect added. And then you want to head over to the right hand part of the screen and you're going to see here, remove a color. And then click on this down arrow and you're going to want to click on the little eyedropper thingy. Click on that and then click on the green screen that you want to remove. So there you go, it's removed the background. Now you'll see a little bit of green haze. That's because I'm moving really fast. I find that when you, when you move your hand really fast or you're just doing fast movements, that it doesn't capture it as well and you can see a little bit of the green haze. But if I move the cursor and I'm just standing speaking normally, it removes it for the most part. All right, so once that's removed, you need to add your background. This could be a moving background, or it can be a still background, or picture, like whatever you want it to be, you can put behind you now, because you've removed the green screen. So I'll show you how to do the video first. So in that clip you saw like I was pretending to be underwater. So I have the underwater clip here, and you want to make sure that you put your clip or your picture or whatever below your video because if you put it on top, it's going to go over you and then if it goes over, then you're, you're not doing the background thing properly. So you want to make sure that whatever background you want, it goes below your video and I'll show you the example right now. So I'll drag this and I'll put it on the top and you'll see that it covers. It covers me because it's on top of the video. You want to make sure to put it below because now it's going to go behind. So now you can see that part of me is underwater now because I have put it behind me. So let's put this here and we'll just position this like we can just stretch this out to make it fit the screen. And now it looks like I'm underwater and I believe this clip has underwater sounds too. So let's just play it to see what it looks like. 
so now that we have everything set up. So it's lagging a bit because I've got two things going on at once. Uh, let's, I'm just gonna stand in front of the screen and let's see what uh, Basically, you can hear the underwater effect and you can see, and it look, kinda looks like I'm in an aquarium. It looks like I'm underwater right now. So that is how you do it with a video clip and you can download you know, free stock footage off of YouTube and then put that behind you. So let's show you how to do it, like let's say with a, a still picture. So let's head over to annotations and let's say you want the background to be like a different color. So we'll head over to annotations, we'll head over to shapes and we wanna get the rectangle shape. And again, we'll put it below. So right now it's above and we'll just put it down here. We'll stretch it out and then we need to size this. So now, as you can see, my background is changing colors, changing to white. So now it's like this clean background. So you can change it to whatever color you want. You just head over here and you can just go through and change it to whatever color you want. So uh, that actually looks like a cool color. Let's see here. There's green. Let's do blue. Purple. Let's leave it at purple. So this is also a cool effect because it makes it like really clean and you can put like text or whatever you want while you're speaking. You can also do this with pictures. So it's the same thing. Basically, you import your picture in the media and then you put it down here and you can have the picture as your background as well. So that is how you use the green screen effect on Camtasia 9. If you want to check out my green screen unboxing video, you can head down to the description below or it'll pop up somewhere on the screen. All right, guys, so if you like these types of Camtasia videos, head down to the description because I've got a whole playlist of a whole bunch more tutorials for free on Camtasia 9. And if I was able to help you out at all, please let me know by giving this video a like, a comment, or subscribe. All that would be very much appreciated. Alright guys, well thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.